There's a changing of the guard at the National Library of Australia. Ryan Stokes, the son of media mogul Kerry, is taking over as chair from former judge James Spiegelman, who's now chairman of the ABC. One of Ryan Stokes' priorities is to accelerate the process of putting the library's huge catalogue online. Well, Ross, it is. It's, it's certainly a key objective for the library, and I know it's been a, an agenda for the last 10 years. So the digitisation, I think, in total, there's almost 300 uh, various pieces, around a million various pieces that are digitised. So when we look across the, the publications, the photographs, the newspapers, there is a, a, a tremendous volume of work that's been done. There are restrictions on copyright that obviously needs to be taken into account, but we believe as much as we can continue to digitise to provide greater access, it's going to be in the libraries and uh, the nation's interest. Is there still a place uh, for physical books in this world of uh, search engines and iPads? Uh, I, personally, I'm a believer that there is, and I think it's really important and uh, incumbent upon the library to continue to preserve that physical history. That physical uh, heritage is an uh, important aspect for all Australians going forward. Uh, that's a responsibility. I think also alongside that, providing access uh, to this digitised material is, is important as well. And in 10 years' time, children will still need to go to a library to get a book off the shelf in order to do their research. Uh, well, that's another question, uh, whether they need to or not, or whether they, they want to. Uh, and uh, I, I think it is something that they'll probably have flexibility as to whether it's in a, a form that's uh, available digitally or, or, or physically. And I think it, it's important to have both, but it's particularly important to preserve that, that, that physical component. As you've mentioned, the library is also a place for printed newspapers as well as books. What is the future uh, of four printed newspapers in the face of these changes this week announced by both uh, Fairfax and by News Limited, who are shedding jobs to shift more towards a digital platform? Is there a, a future for the printed press here? Uh, I think there is certainly a, a long future for uh, strong, good quality journalism uh, in printed and digital forms, and I, I suspect and believe that that will, will continue for, for a long time to come. I, I think that this uh, technology movement will continue to uh, have its influence across a number of industries and sectors. Uh, it's a matter of embracing the opportunities and, and uh, uh, taking uh, on the, the challenges that that brings. Brian Stokes, thank you. Thank you very much.